I hope you're doing well welcome to a new video I am Caro and today we are going to the city we're going to Brooklyn and to Manhattan which are two hours away from where we live we are going to see art shows and I thought it would be a great idea to bring you along the way a lot of artists that I love 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 have artwork being shown right now and one of our good friends, Dada, who now lives in Costa Rica, is visiting the city for a couple days. So all the good things are happening in the city right now. So we are going today, right now, we're taking the bus. Um, we're sleeping at our friend Mariana's home. And then we're, we will see a couple other art shows tomorrow. And then we come back to work. So let's go for a little ride to the city and let's go to see lots of artwork from very different styles of art, but all of them are artists that I love and themes that I love. We're gonna see some fungi art, some flesh doser psychedelic art, some Peruvian Amazonian art. I don't wanna spoil it, but let's go for a ride. This exhibit is called Human Nature Entanglements and it's about fungi and how we can learn to create with other creatures that are not humans. Welcome to my fire escape. <laughs> ¿Qué estás tomando, Mari? Estoy tomando cacao de la selva y de Cusco. Yeah. Salud yeah. por el Perú. Hoy ganamos con tus manos. <laughs> Y 
Hello, today Eva and I are in Manhattan. We came to the city yesterday because one of our closest friends, Dada, who we were roommates for a time, who used to live in Brooklyn for 10 years, moved to Costa Rica last year, and Dada has been in the city for just a couple days, so we came over to see him. Um, and we stayed the night with our friend Mariana and her cat friend Rapa. And yesterday we went to see, I don't know the correct term, but Evo's cousin's wife, Isa's show. Isa is working on eco design based with mycelium. And it was beautiful because we got to see not only Isa's work with the mycelium and what she has been creating with it in terms of building blocks for eco-design, but also to be guided throughout this show by Isabel herself. It was just so interesting. It, it's more than I can even understand, um, but it was such a beautiful, inspiring experience to go to Isa's show and to be guided by her. And today, before going back to Kingston, we're going to two gallery shows. We are first going to go to Revolver Galleria, which is a Peruvian gallery here in New York and they are currently showing the work of Christian Mendayan. Christian Mendayan is a Peruvian Amazonian artist from Iquitos and Christian and Christian is one of my favorite Peruvian Amazonian painters. He's one of my favorite painters. Um, actually when I was in college I got the amazing opportunity to work with him for a little. I made a intaglio edition based on Christian's work and you know i got to go to christian's art studio back in lima and he also came to my college and we worked on this beautiful intaglio plate plate together and his currently new show opened last week so we're gonna catch that before getting to catch our train back to kingston and we're also gonna go see flesh dozer's current art show which opened a few days ago maybe like three days ago um, Flesh Doser is an artist who I really admire. I feel like her work is not only beautiful, mind-blowing, but it's technically just out of this world. And um, neither Eve or I have seen Flesh Doser's paintings in real life. We've only seen Flesh Doser's art through the internet, so I'm pretty excited for that. And I hope that we get time to see both shows before having to catch our bus, not train, back to Kingston. So yeah, you are welcome to come to some galleries with us before we leave.
and we're back in the studio. I hope you enjoyed today's video, that all these amazing artwork brought you some or a lot of inspiration. Thank you for watching my channel, for being here. Feel free to subscribe if this is content that you enjoy. And I am around the internet on Instagram, on TikTok, on Minds, on Patreon, and on the metaverse. I'm not on the metaverse. I'll never be on the metaverse. Anyhow, I hope you have a beautiful rest of your day. Bye.